Hey Gemini, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nelly, aka Owl Tarot, and I'm here to give you guys your daily message for the next 24 to 48 hours. We're going to tap into this energy, see what is coming towards you guys. But before we get started, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell so you can be notified when I post a new reading. If you are a returning subscriber, guys, thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Alrighty, Gemini, as you all know, these readings are for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. These are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. And there is no gender in tarot. Please reverse the rules as need be. Cross watchers, you are always welcome. Guys, don't forget to check your other placements so you get a better understanding of this energy. And if you would like to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. So let's get started with the energy for the next 24 to 48 hours, and then we'll go into the tarot. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guys, and Guardians, what's going on with Gemini here for the next 24 to 48 hours? You got the Patience, Angel of Balance, okay, and Indecision, okay. And you're releasing some attachments in the bottom of the deck in the reverse, okay? All right, guys, so I have patience in the upright, indecision, and angel of balance. There is something that you're patiently trying to figure out, something that you're going to get ready to release, and it's going to bring a lot of balance to you. I don't know, maybe you're walking away from a situation, an employer, a relationship, but something that's been very imbalanced for you is finally going to get ready to start balancing out. You've been very patient with this. You've been very patient with trying to figure out what your next moves are and i think it's about that time let's see here what else do you for gemini universe what else is going on here four of swords and the hierophant are you guys walking away from a marriage because i got the hierophant in the reverse and i got the four of swords this is you going with an isolating trying to figure out what your next move is and i feel that a lot of you guys are making a decision to walk away from a higher level commitment someone that you were married to here what else you know? the king of pentacles you just don't in the reverse you just don't see any forward movement in this connection anymore wow this is going to be a tower moment this is going to be a life changing um decision for you some of you guys are just tired of a situation just tired of the imbalance and, and you're just wanting to walk away you've been very patient with the situation shit you've been very patient with this person but you finally realize that there is no more forward movement here you're sitting like this queen of pentacles right now i think that you're financially ready to make this move you're financially mentally physically and emotionally stable to make this move and i think that you've mentally prepared yourself to move on from the connection here what else universe Five of Wands in the reverse. You're tired of the fighting and you're just tired. You just want the truth to come out. You want the truth to come out already. And for a lot of you guys, you may you may be serving somebody with divorce papers here. Knight of Wands here. There's a lot of passion. Like what you're getting ready to do, you've you've really soul searched the situation and now you've just gotten like that that passionate energy to move forward with this decision like you're like okay i've decided i'm gonna do this let's get it done let's get it let's get it over with eight of swords you're coming out of this depression energy you're coming out of this lack mentality for a long time i feel that a lot of you guys were stuck in your head because you weren't sure what you were going to get ready to do was it going to be right or wrong and you finally have gotten that clarity and you've decided a lot of you guys some of you guys may have even gotten um some divorce papers served and you've been like trying to go back and forth with it but you finally decided to sign these divorce papers or vice versa you've sent them out to your person but here with the nine of cups in the reverse you don't see any more wish fulfillment in this connection no more there is too much grief um whoever you were dealing with has changed too much and you like i said you've been very patient with this person and there's just nothing else to look forward to in this connection. Knight of Swords, this person has been very reckless in this relationship, very disrespectful, not giving a crap. Look at with the judgment in the reverse, this person hasn't been a lot has been denying a lot of things that he or she have been doing, and you've caught them on those lies, and you're just like basically you're tired of it. Queen of Cups, you're pulling your emotions from the connection. This person could be very emotionally manipulated as well, very codependent. 
with the Knight of Cups here, you're, you're walking away. You're walking away and you're taking that cup of love that you've been offering this person for such a long time. You've been trying to get this person to understand that you do love them and you want to work on this connection, but they don't. So you're walking away. You're walking away with the death, yeah? You're ending something and you're opening up the door for new beginnings. You have come to terms that this relationship is dead. There's nothing that's going to change it. And it's time for you to walk away with the Eight of Cups. Yep, it is time for you to walk away. You want to get out of this Nine of Swords energy. You're tired of being stuck in your head all the time trying to figure out what went wrong in this connection. And you're over that already. You're detaching yourself and you're moving towards victory with the chariot. Some of you guys are packing up that car as we speak and you're walking away from this connection. The wheel of fortune in the reverse, you have come to realize that there is no forward movement in this connection. On the contrary, there is no more love here. There is no more love with the with the ace of cups. And you've understood that, you understand that you're okay with it, you've been patient with it, you've detached, and you're good to go. I feel for a lot of you guys, you're good to go with this decision that you made. You're comfortable with your decision. Five of Pentacles, you guys are leaving a connection out in the cold. And the world here, you're closing out a cycle. Yep, a lot of you guys are ending this connection because there's nothing else you can do about it. There isn't anything else, any other way that you can fix this connection but walking away from it. Walking away from it and basically just looking out for yourself and your family if you have any children. But a lot of you guys are really thinking about filing some divorce papers and calling this completely quit already like you're done you're you're walking away and it's a closed chapter in your life all righty gemini i hope this reading gave you some form of clarity please don't forget to like share and subscribe click that notification bell and if you guys want to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below take care bye